sees a piece of history now reaching a historical turning point the Philippines has become Asia's newest investment capital rising along the shores of Manila Bay is the Philippine entertainment city soon to be the country's biggest commercial district spread over 1,500 hectares of land soon to become Asia's tourism capital the Philippine entertainment city straddles three major cities of Manila Pasay and Paranaque divided into seven zones cultural financial commercial zones 10th largest mall in the world where SM Mall of Asia is located Asiana Business Park Padgar Entertainment City Asia World a residential area and Centennial City for mixed-use development the Philippine Entertainment City is accessible to any place in Metro Manila via major thoroughfares Rojas Boulevard EDSA Cavite Coastal Road and Makapagal Boulevard Metro rails are only 15 minutes away these trains can bring you to various points in Metro Manila within 20 minutes the Ninoy International Airport is only 10 minutes away from the Philippine Entertainment City bus terminals are also available within the Philippine Entertainment City as well as ferry terminals where one finds boats going to Bataan in the north of Manila and to Cavite in the south. Future infrastructure projects include the LRT extension phase 2 that will go all the way to Bacoor, Cavite and will be completed in two years and the Naia Skyway phase 2 that will connect the Philippine Entertainment City to all international airports. The Padcor Entertainment City is the biggest tourism project of the Philippine government through its agency, the Philippine Amusement and Gaming Corporation. Four locators, each with at least one billion US dollar investment, were awarded the franchise to operate gaming and research facilities in the over 110 hectare complex. Soler Resort and Casino is the first casino resort complex that opened on March 16 of this year. Season executives from five-star casino resorts in Singapore, Macau, and Las Vegas are managing its operations. Soler is a $1.2 billion project with 500 luxuriously hotel rooms. It also features a sprawling pool deck, a convention center, and a fully equipped spa and fitness center. The resort's expansive casino area is designed to provide a true Las Vegas gaming experience. Resorts World Bayshore Casino Resort is a joint venture between the Philippine-based Alliance Global Group and Genting Hong Kong. It is a 1.1 billion project on 31 hectares property. It will showcase a world-class theme park, the Grand Opera House, and the landmark of the entertainment city, the Observation Tower, one of the tallest in the world. It is scheduled to open in the fourth quarter of 2016. Manila Bay Resort is a $2 billion project on 45 hectares of land. It is owned by Japanese casino mogul Kazuo Okada. It will boast of an impressive indoor man-made beach and close in a glass dome, three hotels, a museum, and over 150 high-end retail stores. Manila Eye, a 394 feet high structure with an oceanarium inspired by the famous London Eye. Manila Bay Resort is scheduled to open in the fourth quarter of 2016. Belgrand Manila Bay of Bell Corporation is a $1 billion project on a 6.2 hectare land. It will feature high-end retail shops, restaurants, 
state-of-the-art theaters, and six hotel towers inspired by gold bars. The partnership with Melco Crown, a major Macau casino operator, is expected to boost its stature in the international gaming arena. It is scheduled to open in the second quarter of 2014. When completed, the entertainment city will generate more than 6,000 hotel rooms, 3.3 million square feet of casino gaming areas, and will create more than 25,000 new jobs, which will compound to more than 1.8 million jobs for the entire Philippine entertainment city. The SM Mall of Asia Complex is the leading family entertainment, shopping, convention, and business center in the Philippines. Over 200,000 people go to Asia Mall of Asia to shop and dine every day. The complex are the country's biggest gathering places, the SMX Convention Center and the Mall of Asia Arena. Strips of outdoor restaurants like San Miguel by the Bay offer numerous dining options for visitors. BPO buildings and corporate offices such as one and two e-com offices have mushroomed in the area. Now is the time to ride the rising tiger of Asia, the Philippines, Asia's rising star.